I've seen the programme One Man and His Dog. Oh, For yeah. those of you who haven't, I want you to imagine that you're 50 foot up in the air looking down, and I want you to think this arena as a clock face. And what happens on One Man and His Dog is the man stands at 6 o'clock, he sends his dog up the field to 12 o'clock, and the dog brings the sheep, or in this case the geese, in a straight line down the field. When we start off training the sheepdog, we use the same principles. I get a young dog and I encourage it to run round the sheep or the geese. We stop. And as soon as it goes one way, I mirror the movement that it makes. In other words, if I'm at six o'clock and he's at 12 o'clock and he runs around to three o'clock, I move to nine o'clock. As soon as he goes to one o'clock, I move to seven o'clock. And no matter which way he goes, for the rest of his life, unless I tell him differently, he must always be opposite to me. And that's why a shepherd can stand at the bottom of the hill, send his dog for sheep he can't see, and it'll always bring him back in a straight line, because it's always been taught to. And as it runs around one way, we give it a command, and as it runs around the other way, we give it another command. There's four basic commands to run a sheep dog. Left, right, stop and go. But we don't say left, right, stop and go. For the dog's left, we say come by. And people say, why don't you just say left? With come by, I can split it. If I wanted the dog to move a few feet, I would say come. But if I wanted to go all the way around, I say come by. For the dog's right, we say away, away. To stop the dog, we say lie down. And to make the dog move, we say walk on. And using those four basic commands, we can work a field of sheep, or in this case, the geese. But the most often asked question I get is the whistles. What do they mean, and how do they understand them? We're now in the mobile phone age, and if your mobile goes off, you immediately recognize the tone. And it's exactly the same with the sheepdog. He is given a variance of different whistles. His right, come on. His stop, come on. His left, come on. And his walk on, come on. Now that's the easy bit. Where it gets a little bit more difficult is when you're working more than one dog at the same time because they're not only listening for their own commands, they're listening out for the commands of the other dog, because they are taught not only their own commands, but they're taught to ignore the commands of the other dog. And I'm going to try and show you that using a very young dog called Sweep. <laughs> now, when you work in a couple of dogs, the most difficult thing sometimes is getting dogs of the same strength. It's like two people. If you have two people carrying a table, one's strong and one's weak, the balance isn't very good. And at the moment, this dog is quite strong and wants to do all the work. And it's about to get that flow together. Those that had seen me maybe a few years ago would have seen my great dog, Billy. And I had a bitch called Di that I worked with them. And they worked like two peas in a pod because they uh, accepted, you know, the work together. Whereas these two, one wants to do it and then the other wants... And if I growl at one, it can affect the other. Lie down. Lie down. Now when I put the light... Li ah! Lie down. Look, that's the back and the front deer. <laughs> Lie down. When I'm putting the commands, they know because they know it's going to race over there. <laughs> now we're going to bring out another uh, one. Now this bitch, she likes them to do all the work. <laughs> so with her, I've got to kind of raise the voice. And she'll try and hide behind the pen or something like that. So they all have to do the work. I'll try and show you. <laughs> Lie down. <laughs> Lie down. Nell, get up. Here, Nell. Here, Nell. Here, Nell. Come on, Nell. Lie down. Lie down.
Get up. Come on, Nell. Get up. Get up. Get up. Come on, Nell. Hey, Nell. Hey, Nell. Hey, Nell. There. There. Lie down. She's looking for somewhere to hide. Okay, we're going to drop these away. Lie down. Lie down. Lie down. Lie down. Now get up. Ah, lie down. Now get up. Now, come on, get up now. Come on now. We now. Lie down there. Steady. Swing. Come on, swing. Come on, swing. Come on, swing. Now get up. Come on, now get up. Come on, now. She's wanting to do all work. There you go. Anyway, that's Joe's.